know that you know I am not a Catholic. I'm an Episcopalian, but I'm but I'm very high church. I like I like being high church. Church has always meant a great deal to me, and it's, it's emotional to me to go to church. In fact, I wished I wanted to be a nun. You know, when I was you know when you were about thirteen. You know. Father Kaiser, my Father Kaiser is what we called him. First of all, very big and handsome and nice, huge big man, big white hair, handsome, huge, and lovely, lovely man. And what I liked about it, we did it at CBS, and we did, it was filmed, but it was, this was, it was more, more theater. This was, this was not live, but it felt like it was live. So you work at Fairfax at the big studio it's there at CBS. And <clears throat> when I, would, I was in the midst of getting a divorce, my marriage was falling apart, I had two little kids at home. And so I, the job meant whatever it paid, and I don't think it paid much, but it, that's what it was about. So father stands in the doorway and he's charming and I, he handed me a check. I would, I would love to know how much it was. I don't think it was much. And I, I kept that check. Because uh, I, I, had bef I had done two before. I had two, done two before him. And you would, what we would do is we would uh, uh, donate it back. We wanted to. So I thought, I gotta, I gotta keep this. I, keep, I gotta keep this check. And he, we had a lovely chat, maybe too long, too long a chat, and I got home with that check. <laughs> but I always felt bad about it. Every time I would drive by the, the church or, the, or, or along Santa Monica, by the big offices down there, I would think, oh, I got, I got. So finally, when I did better, then I did pay them. I did pay them plus, 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 made, made up for it. I love to talk about Ed Asner because at, when I first met him, uh, at some big event, we all went to to uh, Hawaii together, or and 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 I found him rude, uh, and and all kinds of and and a bad dancer and and just just on just everything wrong. Okay, so now years go by, and then they said, "Here's a thing you can do with Ed Asner." I said, "Ed, Ed Asner." And I wrote, Ed Asner, and I wrote on the paper, no. And I, almost at the same moment, I did, I did a turnaround. And I decided to woo him. So I said, yes, let's. So the minute I saw him, I was all over him. <laughs> Can you imagine that? So that made all the difference in the world. And we're close, dear, dear friends. And of course he's difficult, hard to handle, but, it's a, but he's a challenge. Yeah, I love him. I wonder how young she was. She could have been 15, 16, I think so. From then on, tremendously interested in Laura Dern. And to see her big career now, it's exciting. Isn't it exciting? So as you can see, you, you only got good actors that wanted to be on those shows. No. And you had to be a good actor, because it's important. And it was an honor to be in one of those shows. Those were good scripts. Good, excellent scripts. I mean, this isn't cheap stuff. It meant something. Mm -hmm.